Welcome to the dungeon. Let's play dance. Hi guys, what's up? Gonna try something a little different today. I'm gonna play best of five legs 501 against the N01 app at level nine. Um, you may know the uh, N01 app. You can get it on your um, phones, tablets, computers. Um, really good for playing online against a computer at different uh, standard levels. And also you can play online against um, other people playing across the world. So I'm gonna play um, as I would sort of Super League style now. Um, gonna get the uh, scores up on the screen as well as a split screen of me and the board and let's see how um, we get on I'll give you a bit of analysis as I go on my throw um, and what my thinking is about checkout routes um, and that sort of thing so uh, here we go let's have a look little thumbs up there to the camera just to let myself know exactly where we are starting from when we get going with the edit so uh, snap straight into the fives and managed to cover downstairs um, quite handily there. 81 solid start, um, would be more than happy that in a Super League game. Um, I'm playing against level 9 on N01. Uh, it's usually 8, 9 is about um, the Super League standard that I play in between 20, 25, 26 up to that point. Um, so uh, I chose to go for that level just to give you guys a good idea um, are the sort of standards that you're expected to hit at the top end of Super League and the first leg here I sort of ran into a bit of a monster um, thought I would fill that one up there to be honest um, but again I would take 220 after 9 every day of the week um, as the computer there just keeps plugging away with the big scores uh, a rogue dart there into the treble 5 made me have to have a little pause and a think here normally pride myself on knowing my numbers very well and um, that left me with 186 um, so went down to the 19s knowing a 19 would uh, leave me 167 a good out shot um, managed to peg the treble which left me 129 which is a very gettable out shot computer on absolute fire there missing ball for the 161 so I know there's only one way to go here and um, 19s to leave a treble 20 for a shot of the ball and that was absolute garbage um, a massive drag uh, into the small 16s and um, by which point I thought their leg was done there um, computer doesn't normally uh, miss a small shot like 25 but he did he bust his 25 um, and then I had the dart at double 17 bang straight in there um, for your strange doubles like your double 17s I tend to really attack it first dart um, therefore if I come inside um, I can still get myself out of jail with the next two. So the next leg now, 1-0 up with a 16 data. Uh, computer gets a slow start there. And I plug away there, 140. Again, I've not really done anything too fireworky. Um, a couple of 140s in the first two legs there. Um, and I know I'm ahead. Computer hit back with a 140 there. Two really bad ones there. I do sort of get myself out of trouble with a 60 last start to put me on 299 but really we're even Stevens now with a computer and uh, with a ton even though I'm averaging 100 in this leg I'm still way behind. There you go, two poor darts, third average dart and that's pretty much the leg over for me here. Computer's got the throw, 60 odd in front, they had another ton and I'm way behind. Still dragging a little bit for the first start, so a nice little readjustment there. And wander into the treble fives again. Computer set themselves up for a nice easy two data. Uh, so I just plug away on the scoring here, knowing that 59 will leave me a nice 160. Hit the treble. So for my average, that's a great <coughs> dart. Um, I'm never really going to win that leg, but um, if I was going to come back, I would have had a shot, but the computer took it out in 20. So one all. On throw, again, important just to be strong on your own throw. A really good first dart, and you can see how disappointed I am there, um, knocking the next two into the fives. A 70 start isn't the end of the world, but after a trouble 20 first dart, it sort of does hit you in the guts a little bit. Computer just followed with 60, so I know I could work on that. Another drag into the fives. 
and then straighten back up with an 85. <clears throat> Again, on paper, that's not too bad. I'm averaging 76 there over the first two visits, so happy enough. Computer catching up a little bit, so I'm able to plow on. A steady turn, that's a really nice straight one. 246 after nine, very happy. Normally aiming to be under 200 after 12 darts thrown in Super League, um, just to get my scoring side of things up there. So well on track with it in this leg. And then another 100. So well, well in front of where I um, hope I would be. I always want to be under 200 at that point, but giving myself a shot at a 15 darter here. Going for two 57s, which should have left 32. Missing the first one. And then knowing to switch back up for a nice little tidy score to leave me a two darter when I come back. Computer really put on some pressure here, if I remember. Yeah, 140 there. So I knew that this was under pressure. I had to leave myself a shot at the ball, but hit the treble first start. And then a couple of poor ones, to be honest. Um, I like my double 18s, so uh, that one hurt. Thought the computer would probably punish me for that at a level nine. Um, computer just hit a 60. Um, so I knew I had three more here for a 21 data, essentially. Bit of a drag, first one. And then I make the correction for the second one for a 20 dart leg. So a 20 dart leg is um, a 75 average. Again, if you're hitting that in Super League, you're a very good player. Um, the top, top players playing Premier League, Super League in our county are hitting 26, 27s. The very tops are the 28s, 29s. But in reality, they're the ones that could be going to Q School. If you're above 21 or 22, um, you're solid enough to be in every game you play. That's where I am normally. Um, I've not set the world light here, but my average is okay. Starting with a tidy there. And again, not really putting any pressure on the computer's throw. The computer is absolutely miles in front. So this is more about getting back into rhythm at this point, saving the average as well if I can. Um, a couple of good scoring visits and, uh, and balancing out that poor 25, so there you go, a ton there. So it's 125 in the last two visits, which is about my running average, so can't have too many complaints. Finding the trouble 20 quite nicely at this point now, another ton 40, so even though I'm not realistically gonna get a shot, which I didn't, computer taken it out, um, I know those last two visits really were an average bumper, so, um, a bit of confidence to go into uh, the last deciding leg here um, and starting straight off plumb in the treble 20 absolutely beautiful and then another treble 20 to follow that in so um, while there was no real fireworks in my scoring in this game and um, those last three scoring visits were ton ton 40 ton 40 um, but the computer sticking with me there with the ton and so I've just got to plug away and keep relatively steady if I can fell into the fives um, but best part of 100 in front of the computer at this point. Um, so still confident really um, that a 18 or a 21 data will do it for me um, to win this game here, best of five. That's really sloppy. You see I get frustrated. I do get frustrated in um, matches at times. Um, really try not to show it to your opponent if you do. Um, it's a really bad habit of mine. If you can get behind the opponent, obviously not making any noise, but um, if you're going to have a go at yourself, do it outside them. I know if an opponent um, gets on their own back, um, I really find that inspiring um, and I play a lot better. Um, that visit there, rescuing myself with a trouble 19, um, puts me again best part of 100 in front. Um, so in reality, I've got six starts at 178 here to finish off and to guarantee a win. Really nice start there. Just want to throw um, a steady ton, getting frustrated with that weak dart because um, I wasn't really thinking about technique. I was trying to play it too safe and it was a bit airy fairy. And computer hits back hard there, thinking that I'm going to have to take 93. That's a bad dart at 25 because um, I wanted to go 18 for ball. Um, so 74, hit the single 14 going for the treble, and then a single 20 to lay up tops. Um, in reality, in a game, um, the computer or whoever your opponent would be knows that they have to take that 100 out if you've left yourself on tops. If that had gone in the 5 or a 1, 
um, and I left the two data, they get a bit more confidence out of that. So a bit of a snatcher tops, and then for the match in the double ten. So there's no 180s, no huge checkouts. Um, the stats all come up now. Um, 300s, 4140s. My highest shot out was a 40. Um, but what I did do well there was I hit 50% of my doubles. Um, so without setting the world light scoring, um, you can see there a 79.77 average. That's really good. Um, if I had a 20, what's that, 26.2, something like that. If I hit that in Super League, I'd be over the moon. Um, if you're hitting that average regularly, you can see there just by hitting the doubles on your legs um, that you can beat somebody with a 7.89 average um, better than yours as I've done there. Um, I'm nowhere near the computer there scoring wise, but it's taking the opportunities on your own throw. Um, and that's what I feel I do well. Um, I'd be lying if I said that uh, I do that every time, but sometimes in Super League I feel I play an awful lot better than that and have a 22 or a 23. Um, so this game uh, is a really good indicator how um, just staying in legs and scoring steady. There's two 25s in there, I think, and not an awful lot else rubbish. Um, and then a lot of 85s, um, 60s and scores like that, and they will get your average up. Um, so there you go, if you're looking for uh, what sort of standard you need to be playing in Super League, it's a pretty good guide. If you can do what I just did then, you will be one of the best in your Super League. Um, don't be mistaken in thinking that you're going to turn up to Super League. You'll be unlucky if you draw a player who beats you if you throw a 26.1, 26.2. That is going to win you 9 out of 10 games, unless you're playing the best player in the County A team, um, then that's sufficient. And you'll have seen from the way I threw there, it certainly wasn't anything uh, earth shattering. And um, it was just steady darts and hitting the doubles at the right time. Thank you for watching this video on CV Darts. Remember to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. You can also follow us at CV Darts on Twitter.